Once, there lived a sage who was thought to be a very pious person. But he was actually very greedy. Once, an old woman came to him. She said, Oh, pious sage, I am going to meet my sister who lives in the city. I have some copper coins that I have saved up over a lifetime. I have no one to leave them with. Would you kindly keep them in your possession? Oh, respected woman, I do not like worldly things, as I am quite above them. Keep the coins in the corner of the hut, or better bury them. The sage said, closing his eyes in meditation. The woman went and buried the coins in a corner of the hut. Months rolled by, and the woman returned from her sister's house. She went to visit the sage. Oh, revered one, I have come back. May I have my coin so that I can live my life in peace? The woman asked the sage. Go and get the coins from where you had buried them, said the sage. The woman went and dug out the place where she buried the coins. She got the surprise to find the coins missing. She ran to the sage and said, Oh, sage, my coins are not at their place. What can I do if they are not there? You have kept them yourself. I do not know anything about them, said the sage. The woman understood that she had been cheated out of her money. Suddenly, she remembered that a wise man was famous for his intelligence. She immediately went to the wise man for help. The wise man heard her very carefully. After thinking for some time, he said, Don't worry. I will fix this problem soon. Do as I say. He then gave her some instructions. The next day, the wise man went to the sage and said, Great sage, I have heard a lot about your unworldliness. I am going to another city for a few days to meet my cousin. I want to leave it in your custody. Saying this, he produced a bag and opened it. It was full of jewels and pearls. The sage's eyes started shining with greed on seeing so much wealth. Just then, he saw the old woman coming again. If she starts speaking, he will not keep the jewels with me. He thought. Ah, there you are. The sage said to the old woman, I found out in my meditation that you had kept the bag in the northern corner of the hut. Go and dig there. The old woman went and dug up the place, and the coins were there. Just then, a servant of the man arrived. Your cousin has come to visit you here, he said to the wise man. Ah, then I need not go there, the wise man said, and left the place with his bag of jewels. The sage could not do anything.